Hello, my name is William, and this is step three in the fight for our souls, Satan's fear. Fear is Satan's biggest weapon. Now, as we all know only too well, fear can ruin everything we do in life, from work to things like fear of getting into a lift. There are many things we fear, but most of all we fear the unknown, and Satan can use this to his full advantage over us humans. This is why Satan can overturn God's love in us ever so easy. And as you can see, God can't retaliate with fear of his own, having it only love to fight back with. With fear being Satan's biggest weapon against us, making us all suffer at one time or another a hell on earth. And he uses it such a way to provoke God into using more than love, like starting wars, and causing suffering to mankind all around the world. And Satan does have us thinking that any God with his own self will put a stop to man's suffering. For after all, he is the supreme God and even made Satan. This is so-called best friend, but still he does nothing to help man in their hour of need. For only when man learns the real reason for God's lack of helping man will there be any understanding why God is helpless at this moment in time and the main reason he has asked us to have faith. As I have said, fear is one of the Satan's biggest weapons but it will be pointless when he tries to use it on the other side like he did on earth. Satan will put the fear of God into you just by letting you know that if you break the laws of God like the commandments, God will make you burn in hell forever. But when you reach the other side, Satan will still try to use fear and evil to catch your soul. But when you find out that Satan is powerless to use fear like he did on earth, you will start to grow in love for lost souls. Yes, Satan will still try to use fear, but it will be pointless when you know the truth. Satan will show you many things to take your soul away from God and when fear doesn't work he will try the other six deadly sins on you. So don't be naive to think he is finished just yet. So know right now fear will not be a factor on the other side and once you learn this it will give you the confidence to save your soul and the souls of others all in the name of Jesus. You will also find out that when you save a soul of a stranger or a friend on this side earth, it will give you a free passport into heaven, for you have shown God your faith in his love. God bless you all, and God's grace.